In the long term, the Keeping in Touch project is about helping them to resolve the issues that are blocking them from accessing the things that they would like to be doing. So when um, the clients are referred to me, they usually have significant needs, are quite stressed. Um, and need support in, in many different areas. So the, the most important thing when I visit a client is to connect with them, um, to get them to feel comfortable talking to me um, and that they are able to engage. At first, I was very, very low. As you can imagine, my husband had had three strokes and, um, so, and I was stuck indoors. And then Carol came round and suggested all these different places that I could go, which, you know, helped me immensely. I went into the hub. So everything in the hub was really, really good for me. Um, I, I had a, um, a man came out to teach me how to go onto the computer, which I thought was really good, because there was lots and lots of things that I didn't know that I could have or was entitled to and they've helped me immensely as regards all of that, as regards getting things done in the doctors, getting things done outside, anything, you know, with the caring, as I say, it, it is hard. And to have days out and places to go, it's, it's lovely. Working with the Keep In Touch programme um, primarily is, is good for working uh, in partnership with the other organisations. It's a good way to sort of tap into the support from the other organisations. The, the other difference with the, the, the Keeping in Touch scheme is that um, I can be there with them long term to work with them and support them in the long term. Many of the services that they will have been involved with previously maybe don't have that luxury, particularly statutory services. They are have time limitations on what they can do. The patients have fed back to me that it's reassuring to them to be able to have a named person to, to reach out to should things start to escalate for them. I can escalate it through the GP surgery but likewise just having that soft touch um, support for the patients is sometimes just enough for, for their well-being to, to remain on an even kilt. The Keep In Touch programme has made a lot of difference to my life. My husband died about nearly nine years now, and I wasn't able to cope for a long time. Sometimes I think I wouldn't bother to listen to anybody I'm under the weather, but somehow she caught my attention, if that's the right word, to listen to her link, um, attach me to the people that do the singing group, and I love it. The link um, support me with transport. The Keeping in Touch program helped me to feel I am not alone. It does something to me because when I receive phone call from the link or family or friends, it does something to you because I would come out here and start singing. My help improve somehow or uh, my mind perhaps yes there is a young lady that she comes to see me once a week you're gonna you know put yourself together and look after yourself do what is is good because you know somebody's coming in <laughs> so yeah you look forward <laughs>